we seem to have a need right now to monitor who's gathering and what their intentions are, and that's incredibly tricky work. After several attempts to make transit safer for Calgarians, the city is implementing new, tougher measures. According to CPS Chief Mark Newfeld, assaults on transit have increased month over month, averaging about one incident per day. He says as we move from pandemic to endemic, increasing enforcement is becoming necessary. Our officers and our city partners have been leading with compassion and services and will continue to do so where that's appropriate. But our expectation is that public safe spaces will remain safe and inviting. And anybody who jeopardizes that safety or people's feelings of security will be dealt with in accordance with municipal, provincial and criminal law as the circumstances dictate. Starting Tuesday, security presence will double from 8 to 16 at most C-Train stations. And that will triple to 24 by the end of this month. Overnight patrols will also go up from four to seven nights a week. And benches will also be removed in problem areas to reduce loitering. Officers were previously targeting most serious offenders and crimes. But moving forward, we'll increase safety measures to include daily concerns, including littering, loitering and drug use. But do the people think it's enough? I don't know if, if taking away the benches is necessarily going to change anything. I mean, you walk down the next summer, Santa any Santa station and you see people sleeping on the concrete. So, Well, even this morning, I was on a train and there was a fight on board and they, they have to like push the emergency button. And I think extra patrol and uh, just extra officer presence or whatever, you know, that will help. Other changes coming include making announcements at stations, indicating that an area is under surveillance and for transit users only. They'll also step up the cleaning of C-Train stations and create a rapid response to repairing vandalized property. In Calgary, Shilpa Downton, City News.